Good morning, everybody. What's going on? So this day has been a long time coming. We got the two valve behind us here, and we're taking it down to Delaware to finally, finally get tuned. Uh, over there, we got the Ram with the trailer. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna start this thing up. We do have to button up a few things. We're gonna put the wheel liners back on, the front bumper back on, because uh, the tuner will be driving it on the street uh, to optimize the tune and everything. Uh, so he did request us to put everything back on, just for our sake, it was easier to have it off while working on it. but. Yeah, the car idles really good. We've been tweaking with it a little bit the past few days. And uh, without further ado, let's get on the trailer. Let's do it. I'm going to do a cold start. Give them what they want. 30 degrees. Hasn't started in what, a day? Two days? Yeah. I'm with that. So, cold start. Alright, so we just ended up buttoning up the uh, wheel liners. He's having some trouble closing that hood and it lines up properly. But And the bumper, and I have yet to see this thing with the bumper and being lowered, and I think it looks friggin' aggressive. Take a look at this. It's like, it looks like it's on the ground. Woo. Low, man. It is extremely low. What are your thoughts? First time Woo. seeing it with the bumper on. I can't wait to hit the street dude. It's finally, it's finally <laughs> can't gonna wait happen. To hit that first pothole, right? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but now uh, we're gonna load up on the trailer, and then we're gonna be on our way to Delaware. It's just like a two and a half, just an under two and a half hour drive. So um, yeah, we'll have a nice little scenic ride. Hopefully, it's supposed to snow slash like sleet, maybe a little bit of ice. So we gotta be extremely careful with this trailer. But uh, yeah, this is the day that everyone's been waiting for. We can't wait to show it to you. Um, unfortunately, the tuner does have so we have to drop the car off and he's gonna work on it when he gets to it we told him to take videos of the it on the dyno um, so we're gonna have to hopefully he gets some good quality videos and we'll insert that in the next video or this one depending on when he gets them done but uh, yeah we hope he feels better and this is it so we'll see you in a second
good. Yeah. Very. <laughs> Very sketchy. It's a little sketchy. Good Very thing we are. Uh, <laughs> good thing we got the right front lip. We have to install. <laughs> Yeah. Probably should have installed the bumper on later, but it, we didn't want to do it down there, so we just did it now. Plus, like I said, we have a new front lip. Everything about this kit and getting it on a trailer are very tight. <laughs> yep. But, uh, yeah, we're going to strap it up, and we're going to hit the road. All right, guys, we're about 53 minutes away yep. from uh, the tuning spot. Wes, what are your goals? What are your power goals? Um, Honestly, originally I wanted to shoot for, like, 450 horsepower to the wheel, which... People say it's kind of like the safe limits of the bottom end on these cars, so I kind of would still like to see that. But after talking to a few people, they did say um, anywhere between, you know, like above 410 is getting a little on the sketchy side because I one guy actually spun her bearing at like 415 horsepower, so it really depends on like the mileage. But honestly, if I if I got like 400 to 420 ish, that'd be fine. Yeah, I think that's conservative power considering <laughs> what are we at 288. Yeah, 288. That's a big spike. Uh, regardless, it's gonna feel like night and day. Yeah, and plus it's just the beginning. Oh, yeah. We definitely want to build the bottom end and make yep. sure we can, you know, get some more power to this thing. We do have the 76 millimeter turbo, so we should have I a think lot that more one's power good. to that. Yeah, it's up. It's good up to like 800 horsepower. Or Jeez, so. that's crazy. Yeah, it's gonna be wild. Damn. But yeah, right now it's a pretty gloomy day out. Yeah, it's pretty. At least it's pretty not snowing. Shitty. We're gonna probably just put you on a time lapse and we'll catch you when we're there. There's not much excitement going on here. 400 horsepower, a little above that, that's that's solid. I can't wait to rip this thing, man. It's gonna. It's been a long time coming, honestly. It has been, yeah. It's, you know, it's fine the day has come. Unfortunately, it's the middle of winter, so I don't know how much we'll be able to drive it after we get it done, but we'll make some time for it. Yeah, it really depends on the weather, but let's hope we get, you know, a couple weeks before the snow comes. Yeah, so. all right, we'll see you in a bit. He had to say it wasn't gonna snow yep. because now it's freaking snowing. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it on camera, but it's all of a sudden just like that it just yep. started coming down really quick. But hey, it is the middle of December, or late December, so I mean, yep. it is what it is. At but, least we're in a four wheel drive truck and not driving that. Yeah, exactly. That thing <laughs> back there probably wouldn't you know, keep up, but uh, at least we're on the home stretch, so we'll get this car dropped off and then we just yep. gotta deal with hopefully it doesn't build up. It doesn't look like it's gonna stick. No, no, it just looks well. like flurries. See, now it's kind of thinning out already. It's crazy. I had to jinx it on. <laughs> yes, so. <laughs> All right, guys. So as you can see, it is now pouring. There is no more, no more snow. I really fucked it up. <laughs> the change of weather. It is what it is. Yep. Um, but I was thinking we're not gonna be able to film too, too much when we get there. So I was thinking while we have some time here, we got. 20 minutes, I'm not gonna talk about 20 minutes, but yeah. um, I was thinking, what would you guys wanna see first? Um, comment down below and seriously let us know for a video. Would you want, like once we get it back, do you want a, like a first driving raw impression video or do you wanna do a cost breakdown, like full cost breakdown? Cause unfortunately just buying the kit alone wasn't enough. We had to get so many odds and ends that they don't tell you about that we had to get off camera. Yeah. Um, that it really tallied up. I mean, we spent, we spent a lot of money on this kit, so yeah. we're hoping, you know, the real hope was to make the content enjoyable and have you guys follow along. But, um, yeah, comment down below if you want to see us do, like, a raw driving impression, like, experience, first time hitting boost, cost breakdown, or any other ideas, or 
my thought was to do like the raw impressions. It's kind of what we do. Like if we install an exhaust, we just go out and drive it and then get our reactions. So. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, both of those videos that we just announced will be filmed. It's just, what do you guys want to see first? I know we've kind of been neglecting posting for a while because, you know, everything going on with holidays and everything. So, um, we really want to... time with the family and friends, though, you know? Yeah, exactly. So, I mean, now that we're back at it, you know, almost a new year. After this weekend, we'll have pretty much most of the weekends to be able to film. So, just let us know what you guys want to see. Um, and we really hope you guys have you know, been following and loving the build, so please just give it a thumbs up. It takes one second to like it, and if you guys could just share it, spread the love, follow us on Instagram. In the end, we really just want to provide the best content as possible. So, And like from day one, owning the Mustang, it's a very common thing to do is to boost it, whether it's a supercharger, a turbo, etc. So like, I know a lot of people, even if you don't comment, have been waiting for this moment like I have, so yeah, we just hope we're trying to provide you know, the best content like Austin said. Mustang's been on the channel since the beginning, what was that? Yeah. It started in 2016, yep. and now we're here, so uh, I mean, we're trying to make it a, a full-time thing eventually, it's just right now it's hard, yep. but um, yeah, let us know down below. We appreciate all the love and support, and uh, we're going to be there in a couple minutes. We'll try and get as much footage as possible, but like I said, with the weather, always ruining yeah, the sucks. fun. Um, we'll see what we can do. The Mustang gods are with us. It's slowly stopping raining and snowing. So that is good because we got to get that thing off the trailer, which was not fun getting on. So I'm sure it's not going to be fun getting off. But <laughs> Yeah, if you've been, at least it runs and drives. It if you've been following us for the Miata build, I don't know if we really put it on the... Uh, like on oh, wow, sorry. I got distracted because there's some sick cars here. I know there's a couple tuning shops here. Track on but yeah, SRT. at least we don't have to push it is what I was getting at, like the Miata. Yes, Ooh, a little Mopar action. Traders, traders, traders. But yeah, we're finally at the shop, thank God. Well, this is where we are. This is our guy right think? here. Should I, should I pull up here, leave room, yeah, and drive pull it up? up? A little farther. Got some cool cars here, a little SRT. But yeah, the last day of not running boost, really. Set you guys up on a time lapse, but this is exciting. I, it might not sound it because I'm freezing yeah, and it's cold. raining, Very cold. but this is actually a really dope moment. I'm glad you guys are here to enjoy it with us because this is the last time, man, before last she's. NA star, or uh, not NA star, but. No. Just, well, technically, well, we could classify it. Well, yeah, never mind. It, it if, if we're getting technical, yet. exactly, it has the same boost, but uh, let's do it. Let's get this off. It's starting to sleep now. Let's go slow. Race car. All right, guys, so we're pretty much going to wrap this video here. Unfortunately, with the weather, we didn't get to film as much as we wanted or what yeah. we really wanted to, but um, we tried to, you know, keep you guys updated with the whole build. Uh, the next video, you know, we'll have it back, and we'll start doing, you know, whatever you guys commented down below mm -hmm. earlier. Like I said, we'll, we'll film that for you, but uh, we're going to eat our subs. Yep. Wes, you got any uh, final? Capriotis in Delaware. Not paid, down. not sponsored, but definitely. It's good. If you take your car to the tuner that, you know, that everyone knows, in the Mustang in world. In the Mustang world. 
Capriotas right down the street. Yes, hit sir. It up. But yeah, we're super excited, like Austin mentioned, and um, hopefully within the next week or so, early in the new year, we'll have this thing mm. pushing a little over 400 safely, and we can really put it to the test. So have some fun. Light those tires up. Oh, yeah. We'll see. But uh, thank you for watching. As always, subscribe, comment, give it a like, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. See ya. Peace.